Recently, I taught a class on Diana Butler Bass's book, Grateful. And in this book, she explores the concept of what does it mean to be grateful? How do we develop that, an attitude of gratitude in the midst of a time when it can be difficult to be grateful? And she wrote this book before the coronavirus pandemic, but it is ever present today. And at the end of the book, she writes a prayer about Thanksgiving, going into the Thanksgiving week and how do we um, have gratefulness during Thanksgiving. And so I bring the words to you today in a, in a way for you to make them your own as you are heading into this Thanksgiving week. So let us pray together. God, there are days when we do not feel grateful, when we are anxious or angry, when we are all alone, when we do not understand what is happening in the world or with our neighbors, we struggle to feel grateful. But this Thanksgiving, we choose gratitude. We choose to accept life as a gift from you, from the unfolding work of all creation. We choose to be grateful for the earth from which our food comes, from the water that gives life and for the air that we all breathe. We make the choice to see our ancestors, those who came before us and their stories, as a continuing gift of wisdom for us today. We choose to see our families and friends with new eyes, appreciating them for who they are and being thankful for our homes, whether humble or grand. We will be grateful for our neighbors. We will be grateful for our planet. We will choose to see the whole planet as our shared commons, the public stage of the future of humankind and all creation. God, this Thanksgiving, we do not give thanks, we choose it. We will make thanks with strong hands and courageous hearts. When we see your sacred generosity, we become aware that we live in an infinite circle of gratitude. That we are all guests at a hospitable table around which gifts are passed and received. We will not let anything opposed to love enter into our lives and our community. Instead, we choose to see grace, the free and unmerited love, the giftedness of life everywhere, as the tender web of all creation. In this choosing and in the making, we will pass gratitude on to the world. Thus, with you and with all those gathered here, we pledge to make thanks. We ask that you strengthen us in this resolve, here, now, and into the future. Around this table, around the table of our nation, and around the table of our earth. Amen.